Today I want to tell you how you can best scope out a place, a new city, a new area, to see if you would want to live there. I'm uh, Will, I've been traveling the USA for the last two years uh, in a car. And I've learned a lot in my journey. I think one thing you want to try is um, living in multiple Airbnbs in the same city. Um, the benefit to doing this is you get to see different neighborhoods. And uh, quite recently, I had an experience where the first Airbnb was only like five, ten minutes away from the other one, but the first one was in a more ghetto neighborhood. It was kind of sketchy, the place was kind of dirty. The other one was just in a much nicer, posher neighborhood. The, na the shopping center around is nicer, it's cleaner. Um, then you, you look over here and then you can see the mountains. It's really nice and scenic. And this has happened multiple times. And I just got to thinking how if you were to simply visit once, go to one vicinity, um, you might just jump to conclusions that the whole city or whole areas like that when in reality, it was just one cluster or region in that neighborhood. Of course, do your research if you can of all the different neighborhoods and stuff. And if you can't afford multiple Airbnbs, go to one and then drive around the area so you can see the different regions. Um, I think a big mistake people make is they go to an area, then they find the two or three spots that they're most comfortable in maybe it's the gym maybe it's the library and they just go to those spots and then they form a perception about the city when in reality that's probably just a portion of the city now sometimes you'll find oh wow the whole city is really like this but sometimes you will find a difference so in this case i found a difference i mean before in that more ratchety uh, shopping center, I didn't really see the mountains as much. And then the area around the architecture was kind of more grungy and dirty and sketchy. Um, so yeah, it's just uh, very interesting how things can change on a dime.